aliens are so crazy, man. Like this, this idea is, is, is mind blowing in a way because it, the idea that aliens, we are aliens in the future mm. and now they are coming back to figure out how to become human again. I think I think there's a possibility to this because it's like where is humanity going now? Mm. Left hemispheric, cerebral, analytical, understanding things rather than inner standing things. Being the observer from out where we see things from outside ourselves instead of seeing them where where we are part of it, like the observation problem within. Um, which was proven, you know, there's this observation issue where we, when we observe something, it changes how it happens, mm. you know, how it actually proceeds, how it, how it unfolds. But the scientist, he is disconnected from what he does. He's, he's trying to be the observer from a third perspective where he's not involved to try and see things. And this is like the alien. It, the alien mirrors this kind of existence where we're, and then now we destroyed God. So now we're trying to find God again with frustration, but the scientist is frustrated. We're like, oh, at CERN, if we don't find a God particle, then uh, then what are we going to do? We can't find a God particle. It's like in the sense that they want to find it because they, they do believe in God, but they have to affirm it through their ideology. It's really weird. But it's like, um, so it's like we're constantly seeking and we destroyed God of the previous aeons, if you, if you, if you want to say it like that. And now we're trying to seek God out through space and time. And I see it as like, what we're eventually going to do is after all this seeking and observing and understanding, which is putting our knowledge of the world underneath us, where we, we see it with superiority as if we are above the world and above nature, we're yeah. in turn over time going to see ourselves reflect in the waters and we are the aliens. We are the individuals who are going to be alienated from the world and from knowledge itself because we've become disconnected from what we do interesting and then it's like I, I see it as and there's this it's so weird because it's just like it represents even the the, the the what people recall as what the gray alien looks like it's like it's the same philosophy of what modern man's going towards it's like just this extremely cerebral untouched with ourselves our shadow in sense we're not trying to understand our emotions we won't express them but mm. we're we're trying to find an answer which is disconnected from ourselves in a way you enjoyed this video and you feel like it resonated with you on a level of magnitude and you feel like procrastination is also something that you are dealing with and you're always following and falling down the convenient path that is always easier and never actually good for you and you want to break the cycles of procrastination that you're constantly in and you want to stop giving yourself away to these easy, simple pleasures that don't fulfill you, and you want to work on developing your own decentralized freedom when it comes to building good habits for yourself, then sign up for a free consultation call down below with me, and we can talk about the methods and the techniques that you will need to know so that you can develop those aspects of yourself to reach a greater, higher potential. So with that said, make sure to click on the link in the description below, and I look forward to talking to you very soon.